everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a very exciting video so yes today we are going to be decorating my room for halloween i'm so excited so uh i am doing this very early um it is you know almost the end of july and yeah i agree that it's pretty early to decorate for halloween but it's my room i can do what i want and soon i'm going to be filming like videos for 31 days of Halloween like next month in August so I kind of want to have like a different background for that and so yeah I thought let's just get started on decorating now like I just don't want to wait anymore I'm really excited so that is what I'm doing today and I'm going to be bringing you guys along with me so yeah I'm super excited I've got my tubs here that I uh organized where's the other one um there's one there oh here they are <laughs> here are the other two tubs that I have that I recently organized so hopefully I don't mess them up because I literally just did that not too long ago so yeah I'm really excited so the theme for my room this year is Harry Potter um like dark arts and you know um just like I don't know death eaters and stuff like that so like dark magic the dark side of Harry Potter that is the theme in my room this year and yeah, I'm really excited. So, sorry, I'm a little bit out of breath because I'm still getting over my sickness a little bit and I just brought those tubs down. So, I'm a little bit out of breath right now. So, sorry about that. Um, but yeah, so I am really excited. The only thing that I'm not doing in this video is going to be changing my bedspread because I do have a Harry Potter Slytherin themed bedspread. I'm not going to be doing that today just because I cleaned my sheets not too long ago and... I don't feel like doing it today. They don't need to be done just yet, but but the next time that I do clean my sheets, I will be switching them out from these ones and then putting my Slytherin um, like uh, bed sheets on them. So I'm just not going to be doing that today because like I said, I cleaned them recently, so they don't need to be done right now. So yeah, that's the only thing that I'm not doing today, but you will probably see that in like a vlog in the future. But um, yeah, so I will have a Harry Potter Slytherin bedspread um, soon on my bed, but just not for today. So that's going to be, you know, included in the theme as well, but I'll be doing that another time. But yeah, I'm really excited. So I'm going to switch the camera around, show you guys what my room currently looks like. I mean, you guys know, you've seen my room plenty of times recently, but um, yeah, I'm going to switch the camera around so you guys can see what it looks like at the moment. And then we'll get started on decorating. All right, so this is what my room currently looks like. So this is what I put up for halfway to Halloween. If you guys remember, it was like a horror slasher theme. So yeah, this is all going to be taken down. Um, I've had this up for a while and I just want to change it, you know, so. And I also just really want to decorate for Halloween. I'm going to be taking this down and uh, yeah, starting from the top. So. I'm really excited. I'm probably just going to do like time lapses to be honest so I can like concentrate. So that is what I'm going to be doing uh, for this video. So I'll set you guys up somewhere so you can see me like putting all the stuff up and yeah, I'm really excited. So I'm going to obviously take this stuff down first and then um, get started on decorating. So yeah, I'm super excited. Um, so yeah, let's do it.
you guys. So I think I'm done decorating for now. You never know, I might add stuff here and there because it is still July, you know, and we're getting a new wizarding trunk box next month. So there might be something in there that I could add to the decorations, you know, since this is a Harry Potter theme. So yeah, you never know, could still add stuff along the way, but this is what it looks like for the moment. So I'm going to switch the camera around and show you guys what I put together. Okay, so here is my bookshelf. So as you saw, I was kind of like struggling a little bit to start with, although I don't know if you could tell in the time lapse because it was probably going quite fast for you guys, but I was struggling a little bit to start off with, with what to like, you know, start decorating, but I got there in the end. <laughs> so this is what I came up with. So it's very much like potions and sorry that's my neighbor's dog barking in the background there sorry about that so it's very much obviously harry potter dark arts you know potions defense against the dark arts that type of thing and so i got all my stuff that i thought that would go with that theme so i have all of these like deadly poison like bottles here that i thought were perfect for the theme this tale of a rat you know, that's, I feel like that's something you would find in like a potion class, you know, like when you're maybe creating a potion, I don't know, but it just kind of screamed dark arts to me. And then of course I got my Death Eater cup over there and a lot of skulls going on as well. And yeah, and then I got this beware sign in the middle and then I've got some, my, I've got my, uh, black leaves. I thought it just looked kind of like bear like behind the um the sign the beware sign it just looked really like empty so I wanted to fill it up so I put my black leaves behind there and then I also put these green ghost lights they're kind of showing up blue on camera but I promise you they're green in real life <laughs> but yeah I put them behind there because I wanted the green for you know Slytherin so um yeah I just didn't want the ghost because they they do have little ghosts on them and I didn't want to show that so I just put them behind this just to get the light effect um, with the green and then it wasn't really like um, screaming Harry Potter to me so as you can see I've added my little mini um, pop figures that I got in an advent calendar a couple years ago so I added some of those so I got Harry, Hermione and Ron here um, as you can see Hermione is in her cat form um, so I put that one there because instead of the I do have one where she is like you know normal looking Hermione but she's holding a Christmas present because it was an advent calendar so I didn't want to put that there because I was like it's Halloween not Christmas so I put this one and then let's just ignore the fact that Harry and Ron are wearing their Christmas sweaters <laughs> let's ignore that but um yeah so I put Harry, Ron, Hermione there and then over here we've got Crookshanks, Neville I put Neville there because he's holding the monster book of monsters so um yeah i thought that would be good for you know halloween and then we've also got dobby um so yeah i got those over there and yeah oh i forgot to turn this candle on hang on one second um oh hang on it was on come on turn on there we go um but yeah so i got that cat holder there you know black cats i don't know i just thought that went with the theme <laughs> um and yeah, so that's that side. And now um, let's move on to over here. All right, sorry guys. I was waiting for my neighbor's dogs to stop barking because they were going off. So hopefully they've done barking. But if you hear little barks in the background, I apologize. There's dash hounds down the back there and there's like three of them. So yeah, they're very no noisy. So sorry if you hear that in the background, but I've waited long enough and I just want to like show you guys and finish this video. Alright, so here is my set of drawers. I've always got the word there for a second <laughs> of what these are called. Um, so on the top here, it's kind of like a little bit similar to over here. So uh, I've got my good old wicked sign in the middle. And then again, I've got the leaves and the lights behind it. Um, and then over here, I've got these two little pieces here which I don't know if you guys have seen these yet but my mum and I went to this like witchy store 
in Ipswich and they have these pieces and they're handmade and they are so pretty and I love it so much that I thought I would incorporate it with my Halloween decorating for this year for my room so I thought it would be perfect for the Harry Potter theme slash like witchy theme so um yeah it's kind of just like a I think it's meant to be like a witch altar maybe like we've got like a crystal ball here um there's like potion books and stuff like that and like palm reading and just like a whole bunch of stuff and then there's like a little cauldron over there if you guys can see that and then yeah like pumpkins over here and a broomstick and then I have also got this this is from the same shop it's a little broomstick so I thought that would be perfect um so yeah I've got that over there and then this deadly poison like glass thing <laughs> um which is new this year i got that from the berserk website and then over here we've got dumbledore hedwig and mcgonagall um and then i got my pentagram candlestick holders i thought they were perfect for the theme and then over here we've of course got Traco, snape and uh fang so i of course had to put draco and Professor Snape there to, you know, represent Slytherin and represent the dark side. So I've got those guys there. And then I've got this little statue thing here, which is from the Wizarding Trunk, if you guys remember my first one. I believe it is called the One-Eyed Witch. So that is what that is. And it looks very spooky and perfect for the theme. And then, of course, I've also got this palm reading hand thing that... I got a couple of years ago. I can't remember where it's from. Maybe Spotlight, I think. Um, so yeah, I had to put that there as well. And um, yeah, that is everything, I think. But like I said, I could, you know, still add some things, whether we get stuff in the wizarding trunk or, you know, if I keep buying more like Harry Potter stuff, you never know. But that is my Halloween like decorations for my room this year. So um, yeah, I'm really happy with how it turned out and I hope you guys like them. All right, so that is it for this video. Sorry that I didn't really talk that much, but obviously I'm still recovering from my cold and my sickness. And so I've got this really annoying cough. And so I have been like coughing away and hopefully I've like edit edited most of them out because it's really annoying there goes the dogs again <laughs> um but yeah so sorry that I didn't really talk at all but like I said still recovering from my cold and this cough is really annoying and I keep like yeah choking on my words and like also choking on my own spit as well which is really gross so um I've had a couple of like coughing fits here and there whilst filming this so that's why I didn't really talk so hopefully for my actual decorate with me video for um Halloween when I do like the upstairs hopefully I will talk more in that video and yeah so I am really happy with how my decorations turned out like I said I'm not done I could still add some things um, along the way because we still are only in July but this is what it is looking like for right now and I also still have to change my bed sheets as well to my Slytherin ones so I will do that the next time I clean my bed sheets. I just didn't need to do it today because I did it recently. So, um, yeah, I didn't need to do that. But probably like towards the end of this week, I might um do it. Like on the weekend, maybe I will probably clean my bed sheets and put my Slytherin ones on. So that goes with the theme. And yeah, so let me know in the comments below what you guys uh thought of my decorations this year and what was your favorite um decoration I guess and thank you guys so much for watching uh this video um also I hope you guys like the new intro we're going for a more Harry Potter theme at the moment as you can see um I kind of changed it up a little bit so um yeah I changed my channel art as well and my intro so I hope you guys like it and yeah let me know in the comments below have you decorated for Halloween yet I know it's still really early but um that's what us spooky people do we decorate super early so yeah I'm really happy with how it turned out so hopefully I can add a couple more things along the way in the next couple of months I'm sure that I will um so but yeah I'm really happy with how it turned out so far and I hope you guys like it as well and thank you so much for watching this video make sure to give it a thumbs up make sure to subscribe and I will see you all again very soon with another video all right bye guys